Light. I am GC Mathematic. Currently, I am teaching in SMK Noa Banda Sibu. So today we will study about uh, number best for KSSM Mathematic uh, Form 4. Let's go to the learning outcomes. Learning standards. 1. Represent and explain numbers in various bases in terms of numerals, place values, digit values and number values based on the collection process. 2. Convert numbers from one base to another using various methods. 3. Perform computations involving addition and subtraction of numbers in various bases. 4. Solve problems involving number bases. Okay, let's have a look on <clears throat> why we going to why we need to study uh, these chapters. Let's go. Number bases are the keys to all calculations in daily life. Among the fields involved are computer science and other areas that use information technology as the basic of research and development. Let's look at some examples. First, biotechnology. Second, design technology. Third, aerospace design. These are not the only fields that involve number bases. There are more than that. Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, everyone. Uh, before I start my video, I wish to go through this thought with you. What is excellent actually? Excellent is not doing bombastic things. In fact, excellent is doing the ordinary things extraordinary well so to be able to perform in the coming SPM 2021 I wish all of you can do the topic number basis extremely well to be able to be excellence in your maths result why we need to focus on these topics? Reason number one, for sure, you will have two to three questions in paper ones. Because of these topics, we'll have two to three questions in paper one. This means it actually contributing two to three marks, over 40 marks that been allocated for paper ones. So we need to do these two to three questions well. Number two, we do not know whether this topic can become a sub questions in paper 2 or not especially in section C that's why we cannot discount that this topic might come out in paper 2 section C as a sub questions under a big storyline after we know that what is the learning outcomes that been targeted in this topic now we go into more specific what we will do and what we will learn in this topic so number one we will learn where we can find the place value how we can produce the digit value and how we can come up with the number value for different bases number two how we can convert numbers from one base to another basis using calculator method which only able for best 2, best add and best 10. B. How we can change best manually for other bases other than best 2, best add and best 10. Number 3. We're going to do additions and subtractions between numbers of the same best with a calculator for best 2, best add and best 10. B. How we can do the additions and subtractions between number of the same best which are not best 2, best add and best 10. 
Number four, how we can do additions and subtractions between number of different bases. I will show you a few examples so that you can do the questions about place value, digit value, and also how to find the numbers values for different bases. First of all, I show you an example. Example 1. For example, I give you a numbers 3, 4, 1, best 5. If you are given 3, 4, 1, best 5, you want to know what is the place value for each of the digit. We will have to look at the best. This numbers is numbers of best 5. When it is a numbers of best 5, we will write 5, 5, 5 on top of each of the digit. And the power will rise from 0 to 1 and 2 and so on. So when we are doing this thing, we call this as plus value. After that, if we want to know what is the value of digit 3, then it's very easy. We just use 3 multiply with 5 to the power of 2, which is the place value. Then we will have the digit value of number 3, which is 75. Because 3 times 5 to the power of 2 is 3 times 25 which is 75 so the numbers value the digit values for number 3 are 75 if we want to know what is the digit value of number 4 in these numbers we do the same thing we just use 4 multiply with the place value which is 5 to the power of 1 then we have 20 so digit 4 actually carrying the value of 20 so what is the digit value of 1 1 multiply with 5 to the power of 0 5 to the power of 0 is actually 1 so we have 1 multiply with 1 so we're going to have 1 now after we have all the digit value for us to know what is the numbers value for 341 best 5 then it's extremely easy we just plus all the digit values together then we will have the numbers value so we have 75 plus 20 plus 1 so we're going to have 96 it's mean 341 best 5 actually have a value of 96 I show you another examples so examples 2 let's say 1011 best 2 1011 best 2 if we want to know what is the place value because the best is 2 so on top of each of the number we write 2 2 2 same as the previous examples the power will rise from 0 to 1 to 2 to 3 so this one is 0 1 2 3 after we doing this we actually have the place value okay first to know what is the digit value for each of the one inside this one zero one one best two we just have to expand it okay three to the two to the power of three is add okay zero doesn't carry any value so we do not have to calculate it so this one is actually 2 to the power of 1 2 to the power of 1 is actually 2 
the last one is 2 to the power of 0 2 to the power of 0 is 1 right to make it more easy to understand to make it easier the place value is like this 1 multiply with 2 to the power of 3 0 multiply with 2 to the power of 2 1 multiply with 2 to the power of 1 1 multiply with 2 to the power of 0 this is the digit value for every digit in the number of 1011 best 2 so 1011 best 2 what is the number value of it the number value of it is easy we just have to plus all the digit values together which is add plus 2 plus 1 which you can get from this process also it's actually the same process so the value is actually 11 it's mean to say that 1011 best 2 is actually has a value of 11 I hope these two examples will give you a good understanding about what is place value what is digit value and how to get it and what is number value before we get into the changings of number best from one best to another best by using calculators let me introduce you to your calculators if you look carefully on your calculators you will be able to notice these special colors on your calculator buttons which is the words DEC the words BIN and the words OCT these three buttons these or these three words enable you to do the changings of bases for best 10, best 2 and also best add. The first word DEC DEC actually come from the word DECA DECA mean 10 so DEC is actually for best 10 the next word BIN BIN actually is not BIN it's a short form it's actually binary binary means 2 then the last one is OCT OCT is best at alright we need to know how to use the calculators so that we know how to key in numbers for a certain best into the calculators so that the calculators know we are giving it commands regarding certain numbers from a certain best first of all if we want to use the calculators to to help us in number bases we need to go to the functions best as I show you here in the screen you can see you press the mod button until you see these three words come up when you see the best you press in three then you can see the screen of the calculator showing you a B at the side there it means the calculator is ready for number best if we want to key in numbers of best 2 which is 10111 best 2 into the calculators we need to press the button BIN first after we press the button BIN which I have introduced to you previously the calculator will show you a small B at the side there as you can see in the screen the small B means the calculator is ready for numbers of best 2 after that you key in to your calculator 10111 equal and the calculator will show you 10111B 
it means that the numbers 10111 best 2 has been read by the calculators. Continue. If you want to key in 5, 6, 7 best add into your calculators, you need to start with pressing the num the button OCT first. When you press the button OCT, you are actually telling the calculator, hey calculators, now I'm going to tell you a number which is in best add. After you press the button OCT, you can see in the screen that the calculator actually have an O beside the zero there. When you see the O at the screen means the calculator is actually ready for numbers of best set. Just like just now, like just now, you just press the numbers which you want, which is five, six, seven, and you press equal. Then the calculator will show you five, six, seven. O. The O mean OCT la means a number in best add. So at this moment your calculator already register five six seven best add. Now we go to the last number best which your calculator can do for you, which is best ten. Remember that your calculator only can do three type of best. Number one best 2, number 2, best add, number 3, best 10. If you want to key in 791 best 10 into your calculator, the calculator cannot read your be aware of that. So if you want to key in 791 best 10 into the calculator, you need to tell your calculator first. Now I'm going to key in best 10 into calculator. So you you need to do this by pressing the button DEC. When you press the button DEC, you will see a D being shown to you beside the zero there. At this moment, the calculator is ready for best 10 numbers that you want to key in. So you press 791, then you press equal. So 791D means 791 best 10 has been registered by the calculator. So we have learned regarding the usage of calculators by keying in the number of best 2, best add and best 10. Now I will introduce you how are we going to use the calculators to change numbers from a certain best to another best which we can use the calculator to help us first of all we start with a number of best two as you can see on the screen the examples that I'm giving you is one one zero one one best two to change it to a number which is in best add first of all we're going to choose best two then we key in one one zero one one into the calculator as you can see on the screen after you press the equal sign the calculator will register 11011 best 2 then to change these numbers into a best add number you just need to simply press the button OCT which I have introduced to you in the beginning of these sections as you can see in the calculator screen you will you are getting 33 O at the side there. This O indicate that the number is in best add. So the answer is 33 best add. 33 three best add. It means to say that 11011 best 2, when it convert into best add number, it is actually 33 three best add. Next examples that I'm going to show you is how are we going to convert a best add numbers into a best two numbers. As usual, 
we have to choose best app before we key in the numbers 52 into the calculator. After we have pressed the button OCT, the calculator are ready for best app numbers. So at this moment, we're going to press 52 on the calculators and press equal. As you can see on the screen, the calculator have registered 52 best app. So to change these numbers into a best two numbers, we just simply press the button B I N on the on the calculator button. Then the calculator will help us to change five two best add into a best two numbers. So the numbers that the calculator gives us is one zero one zero one zero B. The B stand for best two. So when we convert five two best add into a numbers in Best two, we are getting one zero one zero one zero. Best two. Next, I will show you how to convert a best two numbers into a best ten numbers. So this one will be the last examples. I show you how to use calculators to change from best two to best ten, best eight to best ten, and vice versa. You can after these examples. You can try to play with the calculators with different other numbers and to make yourself familiar with these functions. Okay, now let's get into the questions. For us to convert a best two numbers into a best ten numbers, as usual, we have to press on the button BIN before we key in the numbers. After we press the number the buttons B I N then we key in one one zero one zero then we press equals so the calculator will register as one one zero one zero B the B stand for the calculator read it as a best two numbers for you to change this best two number into a best ten numbers you have to press the button D E C because D E C stand for Best 10. After you press the DEC buttons, the calculator will straight away give you 2626D. The D here stands for, here is a best 10 numbers. So, we have already converted 11010 best 2 into a best 10 number, which is 26 best 10. Next one, we will learn how to convert number bases from one base to another base without the help of calculators because the calculators that we are using is limited only to base 2, base 8 and also base 10. When you want to change base in between these three types of bases, because we can convert it straight away, straight forward by using calculator. But if we are dealing with the other bases which we cannot use calculators, then we have to follow the following process. Number one, for examples, I always use examples to make the student understand. Number one, I give you an examples. If we want to change two one zero best three, a best three numbers, into a numbers in any other best, let's say best five, I want to change two one zero best three to a number in best five. I need to do this manually. Manually means I don't have the help of calculator to do it directly like the examples that I have shown you previously. So, even though I want to do this manually, I need to understand that to convert best 3 numbers to a best 5 number, I cannot do it directly. I have to convert any other bases into any other bases through best 10. 
it means to say that I need to change this best 3 number into a number in best 10 then I do the divisions divisions then I can get the number in best 5 this is the process that you have to stick to when you do the conversions for any other bases. Any other bases means beside best 2, best add and best 10, uh, which you can do with calculator. Now let's go into these examples. How are we going to get a numbers in best 10? This process is slightly easier because we just need to find the number value. Every number's value that we are looking for is actually the value in best 10. So let's start. 3, 1, 0, best 3. How are we going to get the number value? This process you have learned previously in the beginning of the videos. Best 3, so we write 3, 3, 3 on top of each of the numbers. Then we write down the power, 0, raise to 1 and raise to 2. So this one is the plus value as a revision. Lah. To get the numbers value, we just do 3, multiply with 3 to the power of 2, plus with 1, multiply with 3 to the power of 1. Because this is 0, so we don't have to multiply it. Lah. Then we will get 3 multiply with 9 plus 3. Then we're going to have 30. Okay, This one you can use calculator to help you to count. Lah. Now, you have 30 best 10. To convert 30 in best 10 to a number in best 5, we will do divide like this. We put the 30 here and because we want the number in best 5, so we divide it by 5. 30 divided by 5, 6. So the remainder is 0. Then 6 can be divided by 5 again, so we divide it again. So we're going to have 6 divided by 5, so it's 1. 1, 5, 1, the remainder is 1. So the answer will be, we write the answer bottom out. Okay, bottom up means 1, 1, 0. Means that 2, 1, 0, best 3, when converted into a best 5 number, is 1, 1, 0, best 5. The next examples that I'm going to show you how to convert number best of a numbers 1, 6, 3, best 7 into a numbers in best 9. Stick with the process. If we want to convert a numbers from a certain best to another best without using the calculator or we cannot use the calculator, we have to do it manually. We need to change the numbers into a best 10 number first. Then from there, we're going to do divisions to get the numbers in the best that we want. So first, to convert 163 best 7 into a number in best 10, we will do number value. When we find the number value for a numbers, then it is actually in best 10. The value is in numbers of best 10. So let's start. 163 best 7. To find the number value, we will write 7, 7, 7 on top of each of the digit because it is a best 7 numbers. Then we will put power 0, 1, 2 increasingly increasing from one place to another place then to find the numbers value we just times the numbers with the place value so we're going to have one multiplied with seven to the power of two plus six multiplied with seven to the power of one 
plus 3 multiplied with 7 to the power of 0. Then we're going to have 49 plus 42 plus 3. Then we're going to have 94. This 94 is the number value for 163 best 7 and it is actually in best 10. Now, after we found the value of 163 best 7 in best 10, we can use the best 10 number and convert it to the best 9 number that we want. So we write down 94 divide by 9. So 9, 10, 90, then the remainder is 4. Then 10 still can be divided by 9. We divide it again. So the closest one is 9, 1, 9. So the remainder will be 1. So we write it bottom up. So the answer will be 1, 1, 4. Best 9. Alright. So 1, 6, 3. Best 7. 1, 6, 3. Best 7. When we convert it into best 9, it will be 1, 1, 4. Best 9. We will learn how to do addition and subtractions for number bases. Similar to the previous sections, there are questions that you can do it directly by using calculator and there are questions that you cannot do by using calculator that you have to do it manually. Okay. Same with the previous sections. If the numbers are involving best 2, best set and best 10 and if the numbers are of the same best we can directly use the calculators to perform the calculations. I show you two examples for number in best 2 involving additions and also subtractions. Let's get into the questions. First one, when we talk about 11011 best 2 plus with 11 best 2 as you can see here the number best that involve is numbers of best 2 and both numbers they are they are having the same best which is best 2 in this case it is very easy and it is very straightforward you just have to get, go to your calculator by using the mod in best and you choose you set the calculator in BIN BIN means you are telling the calculator now I'm going to perform the calculations for best two numbers if you give instructions to calculator like that then you can do the calculation straight forward like you are counting you are calculating for ordinary numbers you just press 11011 plus 11 just like that then you press equal then you get the answer 11110 best 2 so you're going to have 11110 best 2 so that is how it is so straightforward now we get to the second examples it involves subtractions of best 2 number which both of the numbers are best 2 same like the previous questions you choose the mod best and you set the calculator in BIN when you set it in BIN means you are telling the calculator come on now we are calculating for best 2 numbers after you had get all the setting done then the calculation is very simple you just press 11101 minus 111 then you're going to get 10110B B mean best 2 lah. so the answer is 10110 best 2 it's so simple like that the next examples that I'm going to show you are the calculation involving best add number as you can see in the screen now we are going to calculate 72 best add plus 
1.16 best at. Both numbers are best at and it is a best at numbers. Then we can use calculator to do the calculations. Now we just need to set the calculator in the mode of best and we choose OCT. When we choose OCT, the calculator understand that. Now we are going to calculate best at numbers. So when you have done all this setting, you just have to press like you are counting normal numbers like that. You just press normally, you just press 72 plus 16, then you press equal. The calculator will give you 110. O here mean OCT, mean the number is in best at. So the answer is 110 best at. Now I show you the next examples. It involves the subtractions of best at numbers. Sam best at and it is a best at number that the calculator can help us in the calculations. So it's easy job. Just press OCT to tell the calculator that you are going to cut calculate best at number. Then you press normally 561 minus 42. 42 as you can see in the screen then you press equal when you press equal the calculator will give you 5170 5170 mean 517 best at so the answer is 517 best at after this i will leave you to explore how to do the calculations for best 10 numbers by yourself right you just have to go to the mode best then you choose DEC uh, then you can perform the calculations as usual remember that these functions is only for best 2 best add and best 10 and it only can calculate the number of the same best only remember that same best only we can do additions and subtraction. After we have learned how to do addition and subtractions involving numbers of best 2, best 8 and best 10 by using calculators, now we are going to see how are we going to do the additions and subtractions for the numbers for different best other than best 2, best 8 and best 10 and how are we going to perform the additions and subtractions manually. Before that, before I show you how to do the addition and subtractions manually, I take one example from the calculator question just now and show you what is actually happening during the additions and subtractions for number best. Let's take this example which we have tried just now. 7 2 best at plus 1 6 best at how does this number become 1 1 0 best at we want to understand what is happening during the additions of numbers of best at then we can use the same ideas to perform the additions for the numbers in other best let's go 7 to best at plus with 1 6 best at bear in mind that this one is a best at number when the number is a best at numbers the maximum numbers that can be used in this number is 7 we can use the numbers from 0 1 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. This is all the usable numbers for a numbers of best add. You, you never see number add, you never see number 9 appear in a best add number because when the number reach add, it have to go up one place. Now I show you what I'm talking about. 
2 plus 6. 2 plus 6 is F. Since the usable numbers is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and this number is a best add numbers, so the number add cannot be used here. So if number add cannot be used here, what are we going to do? We're going to take away the add and remaining 0 here. What happened to the add? The add will become 1 in the place in front. So now we do the plus for 1, 7, 1. 1 plus 7 plus 1, we're going to have 9. Since the maximum numbers that can, we can use for a best add number is 7, and the numbers here are 9, so we're going to take away add from it. Right? When the number reaching add, or more than add, we will take away the add. Now we take away the add, what is the remaining? The remaining, the remaining will be 1. So what happened to the add that we take away? It will become 1 in the place in front. So 1 plus nothing, so you will have 1. 1, 1, 0, best add. Okay, so this is what happening for us to get the answer. 1, 1, 0, best add. So that is the ideas of additions for number best. Now I'm going to give you another example so that you can have a better ideas about the additions of number best. I'm going to give you an example in best 5. So 1, 4, 2, best 5 plus 3, 3, best 5. So how to do the additions? We're going to have 1, 4, 2, best 5, plus with 3, 3, best 5. Bear in mind that this one is a best 5 numbers. So if this one is a best 5 numbers, the numbers that we can use in the numbers is are 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. We only can use 0, 1, 2, 3, 4 in the numbers of best 5. Now let's see what happened here. 2 plus 3. 2 plus 3 is 5. Since the numbers that we can use only made up to 4. So when the number reaching 5, we need to move it we take away the 5 from 5, so the remainder is 0. What happened to the 5 that we take away? The 5 that we take away will become 1 in the place in front, because it is best 5. So 1 plus 4 plus 3, it is 8. Same case, best 5 numbers. The numbers that we can use is 1, 2, 3, 4 only. So we're going to take away the 5 from number add, so the remainder is 3. The 5 will become 1 in the press in front, so 1 plus 1 is 2. So the answer is 2, 3, 0, best 5. So that is what happened during the additions of best 5 numbers. Now, let me give you another example so that the idea become clearer. We go to a numbers of best 7. Let's say we have 6, 3, best 7. Plus with 5, 5, best 7. Okay, by applying the same concept, 6, 3, best 7, plus with 5, 5, best 7, so that is the process that is going to happen. And we need to bear in mind that when it is a best 7 numbers, a numbers in best 7, we need to know that the numbers that we can use for this number are 
zero, one, two, three, four, five, six. The maximum numbers that we can use is six. When the number reaching seven or more, we're going to move it and become one in the place in front. So when we have three plus five, three plus five is eight. Eight has already exist six. Right, so we're going to remove seven. Why are we going to remove seven? Because it is a best seven numbers. When we, we remove the seven, the seven will become one in the press in front. So the remaining is at minus seven, one. So one plus six plus five, we're going to have twelve here. Twelve. Twelve definitely too much. Lah. It becomes two digit already. So when 12, it is a best 7, so we're going to minus 7, the remainder is 5. 5 is acceptable because it's within the range from 0 to 6. So this 7 will become 1 in the place in front. So we're going to have 1, 5, 1. So the answer is 1, 5, 1, best 7. I hope with these explanations, you can perform additions for now. Now we go to the subtractions of number best. Like previously, I show you one examples which we got the answers from the calculators. Now we're going to use these examples to verify the process that I'm going to teach you in a moment. We know that from the usage of calculators, when we minus 42 from, when we minus 42 best add from 561 best add, we go in to get 517 best add. For us to be able to do the subtractions of number best manually, we need to understand this example first. Now I'm going to show you what is happening when we do subtractions 5, 6, 1 best add minus 4, 2 best add okay the first question that we're going to ask is is 1 enough to be minus by 2 or not? if it is not enough we're going to borrow from the plus in front now, we're going to borrow from 6. When we borrow 1 from 6, the remainder is 5. When we borrow 1 from the place in front, bear in mind that this one is a best set number. Just now, when we want to add 1 to the place in front, we are minusing add from the numbers that we get from addition, right? So now, if we're going to borrow 1 from the place in front from a best add number, the 1 actually is representing add because it is a best add number. When we borrow 1 from the place in front, we're going to add, add to the numbers that we have. So we're going to have 9. When we have 9 minus by 2, so we're going to have 7. Is 5 enough to be minus by 4 or not? Yes. If it is enough, we just minus like usual. And 5 minus nothing, then we're going to have 5 alone here. So this one is 5, 1, 7, best add. Alright. We try these ideas with other bases. I will give you two more examples to make the idea clearer. Now, for example, I give you 331 best 4 minus 32 best 4. This one is a best 4 numbers. This one is a best 4 numbers. So we minus 331 best 4 minus 3, 2, best 4. Now, 
is 1 enough to be minus by 2 or not? If it is not enough, we are going to borrow 1 from the place in front. So the remainder is 2 there. Now when we borrow 1 from the place in front, bear in mind that this one is the best 4 numbers. The 1 that we are borrowing is actually representing 4. It's representing 4. So we are going to have 4 plus 1. Why it is 4? Because it is a best 4 numbers. Now we are going to have 4 plus 1 which is 5. 5 minus by 2 is 3. Now we go to the place in front. 2 minus 3. Is 2 enough to be minus by 3 or not? If it is not enough, we are going to borrow 1 from the place in front. And the 1 is actually representing 4. Why it is 4? Because it is a best 4 numbers. So we are going to have 4 plus 2. And this one will become 4 plus 2, which is 6. 6 minus by 3 is 3. So 2 minus by nothing, so we are going to have 2 here. So the answer is 2, 3, 3, best 4. The answer is 2, 3, 3, best 4. If this is not clear, now we go to the next examples. I'm going to give you another examples so that you can grab the ideas as clear as possible. So now we go to example 2 for subtractions of number best. Now we try to use a different best. I give you best 7. Let's say we minus 6, 1, 5, best 7 with 43 best 7. 6, 1, 5, best 7 minus with 43 best 7. Now we are going to have 6, 1, 5, best 7 minus with 43 best 7. Now ask. Is 5 enough to be minus by 3 or not? Yes. If it is enough, we don't have to do anything. Like we don't have to do any borrow. But now the next case. 1 plus 1 minus 4. Is 1 enough to be minus by 4 or not? If 1 is not enough to be minus by 4, we're going to borrow from the place in front. The place in front is 6. We borrow 1, it becomes 5. So we borrow 1 from the place in front. The 1 now is representing 7 because it is a best 7 numbers. Now we're going to have 7 plus with the 1. So 7 plus 1 is 8. So 8 minus by 4 is 4. 5 minus by nothing. So we're going to have 5, 4, 2. Best 7. I hope that with these two three examples you can grab the ideas of subtractions of number best manually. After we have learned through all the things that we learned just now about the topics, now let's see what is the examples questions that we might face during our exam. Okay, let's go to the first examples. State the value of digit 3 in the numbers 5, 3, 1, best 6 in best 10. Normally, when they ask for the value of digit or value of numbers, normally the values that we provide is in best 10. Because best 10 is the natural number that we use for normal counting. Now let's go to the questions. 531 best 6. 531 best 6. Now we have to be very uh, alert. What is the terms that they are using? They are using the value of digit. When they ask about the value of digit, we look for the value of digit. 
we're not going to give the plus value, we're not going to give the number value, but we have to give the digit value. Digit value of best three. They are interested in numbers three only. So since this one is a number in best six, so we're going to write six, six, six like that. And then we increase the power from zero to one to two. Now the only things that we are interested in is the digit 3. For us to find the value of digit 3, we just multiply 3 with the plus value. This thing we call it as plus value. So the value of digit 3 is 3 multiplied with 6 to the power of 1. So the answer is 18. You just choose 18 from the list of answer given then you will be awarded one marks now let's us go to the next questions the next questions is a pretty easy questions because it is very straightforward number of the same best and the best involved is best bear in mind that your calculator can perform best two best at best ten. the calculations of number that are of best 2, best add, and best 10. Since this calculator is asking about the additionals of two numbers of the same best, and the best involved is best add, so this is a very good news for us. Lah. So we just go to the calculator and we best. After we log into the mode of best, we choose. OCT. OCT means we are telling the calculators that now we are performing best at calculations. After everything has done with the setting, we just press the numbers that have been given by the questions, which is 254 plus 44. Then we press equal. Then the calculator will show you 320 best at. Ah, then that one is the answer. Next example will be what number must be added to 1 at 2 best 9 to get 504 best 9. You see, when we are getting a number that is not of best 2, best set, and best 10, we already know this one is about calculation. Okay? Manually calculation. So that is the first impressions that we need to get from these questions. So now the next thing is we, we need to go and understand the questions. The question says, what number must be added to 1 at 2 best 9 to get 504 best 9? Mean 1 at 2 best 9 plus with a number that is also of best 9, then we are getting 504 best 9. To solve this problem, we do it normally like what we did for normal mathematic questions. To find the value of x in best 9 from these equations, we are going to have the number in best 9 that must be added. We can get it from 504 best 9 minus with 1 at 2 best 9. That is the ideas of the questions. Now, the next part is whether we can perform the subtractions of numbers of best 9. So, we just put it together. 504 best 9 minus with 1 at 2 best 9. Right? So, 4 minus by 2 is 2. Very straightforward. Can 0 be minus by add or not? Certainly cannot. So we need to borrow from the plus in front. We borrow 1, so the remaining will become 4. Bear in mind that this one is a best 9 number. So when we borrow 1 to the lower plus, so it will become 9. 9 minus by add, so this one will become 1. So 4 minus 1, 3. So the answer is 3, 1, 2, Best nine. The examples that I'm going to show you now is 
a very common question that the exam like to ask. If you go through a few mod model papers exercise, you will see that this question is very popular. The answer that is for this question 16052-7 will give you this answer. So in order for us to get this answer, we need to understand what is place value, what is digit value, and what is numbers value. This is one of the process that involve for us to get the number value, but we haven't add up everything to become the number value. It is still in the process, but the answer provided to us to choose for our choosing is in this form. So we have to know how to get the answer in this form. So we start with the question itself, which is 16052 best 7. Since it is a best 7, so we write 7, 7, 7, 7, 7 on top of each of the numbers. So the power will start increase from 0 to 1 to 2 to 3 to 4. Right? When we go to the place in front. So now, this thing is place value. For us to get the answer, we need to multiply the numbers with the place value, which is 1 multiplied with 7 to the power 4 plus with 6 multiply with 7 to the power of 3 0 because 0 multiply with anything we still get back 0 therefore we don't have to multiply 0 with 7 to the power of 2 we just leave it blank but if you want to write it down you are welcome but in the choice of answer you don't have to choose the 0 multiply with 7 to the power of 2 now we continue to 5 multiply with 7 to the power of 1. Sometimes you don't have to write 7 to the power of 1. You just write 7 because 7 means 7 to the power of 1. So now this one, the last one will be 2 multiply with 7 to the power of 0. Sometimes they just write 2 there because 7 to the power of 0 is 1. 2 multiply with 1 is still 2. Sometimes the choice of answer is 2 multiplied with 1. Sometimes they will just leave a numbers 2 there. And you need to understand that every numbers to the power of 0 will always give you 1. And any numbers that multiply with 1 will become the number itself. So that is the point that you have to be aware of when you are doing number based questions. In the previous questions, we learned how to expand uh, number best numbers, which is in best 7, and how we're going to produce the numbers value. We expand it by multiplying the digit with the best value. Now, vice versa. When we have the expanded form of a number base numbers such as these questions 3 multiply with 5 to the power of 4 plus 2 multiply with 5 to the power of 3 plus 20 plus 1 as a number in base 5. When we are asked to write the answer in a number of best 5 Okay, we try to break every down. We try to break everything down as much as possible that we can see a five in it. Let's see. Three to the three times five to the power of four. We have a five. Five to the power of four. Two times five to the power of three. We have a five there. Five to the power of three. So there is no problem. So we're going to have 3 multiplied with 5 to the power of 4 plus with 3 multiplied with 5 to the power of 3. Now, did you see any 5 inside 20? 
in this number 20, we have 4 multiplied with 5. When we multiply 4 with 5, we're going to have 20. So we're going to have 4 times 5. If we write 5, the 5 actually is 5 to the power of 1. In the previous questions, I notice you and I bring your attention to number 1 because any numbers that we power it with 0 and we will get 1. Therefore, since we want to put everything in the numbers of 5, so the 1 have to be in 5 to the power of 0. So how many 5 to the power of 0 we have here? We have 1 5 to the power of 0 because 5 to the power of 0 is 1. When 1 multiplied with 5 to the power of 0, we get 1 multiplied with 1. Then we have 1. Okay, That is how we are going to interpret the questions. So since we want the numbers and the answer in best 5, we go and look, what is the highest power in this question? The highest power of 5 in this question is 5 to the power of 4. So we're going to start with 5 to the power of 4 and continue with 5 to the power of 3, 5 to the power of 2, 5 to the power of 1 and 5 to the power of 0. Then we put in the coefficients. We have 3, 5 to the power of 4. We have 3, 5 to the power of Hmm, sorry, this one have to be 2. 2, 5 to the power of 3. And how many 5 to the power of 2 we have here? We don't see any 5 to the power of 2, so it is 0. How many 5 to the power of 1? We have 4, 5 to the power of 1. And we have only 1, 5 to the power of 0. So when we sort the situation out, we're going to have 3, 2, 0, 4, 1, best 5. Now we're going to look at one of the tougher questions, not the toughest, lah, one of the tougher questions that might come out in SPM. These questions I retrieved it from a SVP uh, workbook, which I get it from the market. I try to show you these examples. All right. And these examples also give you some ideas about how these questions can be integrated into paper 2. Paper 2 section C. Okay, How number best can play a role in contributing marks in paper 2s. Now let's go to the questions. In a business, Elin get a profit of RM. 1, 2, 1, 3, best 4. That one is not 1,213. Huh? That one is 1, 2, 1, 3, best 4. And 1, 0, 1, 1, 2, best 3. 1, 3, 0, 2, best 4. And 1, 1, 0, 2, 2, best 3. For January to April respectively. What is the sum of the two highest profit he get? You see, huh? because the numbers is in different best, best 3 and also best 4. Therefore, we cannot say that uh, 1, 0, 1, 1, 2, best 3 is higher value than 1, 3, 0, 2, best 4 because they are totally different best. So since all the best that involved here is of the best that we cannot use calculator to get the answers, then we know lah, this one is manual calculation questions. So these questions is very time consuming. Why they come up with such a questions in paper one? Because your paper one has been the, the time for you to sit for your paper one has been increased fifteen minutes compared to your senior. Your senior only have 1 hours and 15 minutes to sit for the paper 1 but when it's come to you the batch of 2021 the times of paper 1 has been increased to 1 hour and 30 minutes so 
they can integrate more questions that is more time consuming in the exam more time consuming doesn't mean it is harder just that you need to spend more times on answering the questions now if we want to know which months have a higher profit better we convert it to best 10 because it is very straightforward since we cannot convert it by using calculator we just find the number value for each of these numbers then we can do comparison now number one we go to one two one three best four one two one three best four to find the numbers value we have to start with the plus value because we times the digit with the plus value we get the number value so 4 to the power of 0 4 to the power of 1 4 to the power of 2 and also 4 to the power of 3 here we're going to have 1 multiply with 4 to the power of 3 plus 2 multiply with 4 to the power of 2 plus 1 multiply with 4 to the power of 1 plus 3 multiply with 4 to the power of 0 by using calculator you will get the answer is 103 103 eh? that one is number value which is in best 10 lah. now we go and calculate the next uh, numbers that been given to us which is 10112 best 3 since this one is a best 3 number so we write best 3 best 3 best 3 best 3 0 1 2 3 4 then we go and find the numbers value so we're going to have 1 multiply with 3 to the power of 4 0 we don't have to calculate because uh, we will get back 0 plus 1 times 3 to the power of 2 plus 1 times 3 to the power of 1 plus 2 times 3 to the power of 0 3 to the power of 0 is 1 lah. so we still need to multiply it so by using calculator you will get 9 5 all right so you can see that this one is lower than this one so this this one is higher pet than higher profit than 95 so we go to the next next numbers which is 1302 best 4 best 4 so we write 4 4 4 0 1 2 3 the now the power so we're going to have 1 multiply with 4 to the power of 3 plus 2 multiply with uh, plus 3 multiply with 4 to the power of 2 0 we don't have to multiply because uh, when we times 0 we will get back 0 and plus with 2 multiply with 4 0 why we need to multiply 2 with 4 to the power of 0 because 4 to the power of 0 is 1 there, there are still value there so by using calculators you will get 114 okay the value is 114 now you can see that 95 is already out from the equation uh, because it is slightly lower than these two answer 103 and 114 then we we still have to check for the last value that been given to us because it still have chance to be the highest pet we, we don't know because it is in best three okay best three so one one zero two two best three so same same with the previous examples we're going to have three 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 the best of the numbers so we're going to have the power from increase from zero to one two three four like that then to find the value of the numbers we're going to have 1 multiply with 3 to the power of 4 plus with 1 multiply with 3 to the power of 3 0 no need because 0 multiply with 3 to the power of 2 you get back 0 now we're going to have 2 multiply with 3 to the power of 1 plus with 2 multiply with 3 to the power of 0 3 to the power of 0 still have a value there please pay attention to this one huh? it is 1 so by using calculators you're going to get 116 you see uh, this is the way that we can know what is the value of each of the numbers now we can see that the highest pet is 114 and 116 this one is the second highest this one is the highest so 
What is the sum of the two highest profit that he get? The sum of the two highest profit that he get is 114 plus with 116. Then you will get 130. Alright? So the answer is 130. Next questions, we will see a relatively simpler questions compared to the example just now. Lah. When we have the numbers 1011000 best 2, they ask us to convert these numbers into a best 4 numbers. Notice that we are given a best 2 numbers and the question asks us to convert it to a best 4 numbers. So if we want to convert a numbers into another numbers which are unable to be done by our calculators, Remember that we need to convert the numbers into a best 10 number first. So now, first thing we're going to think is the strategies that we're going to use, which is 1011000 best 2. We want to convert it to numbers of best 4. This best 2 numbers need to be converted into a best 10 numbers first before we do division to get the best 4 numbers. So, since best 2 can be converted into a best 10 numbers by using calculators, so we, we will use our calculator, we choose the mod best and we start with BIN because BIN is best 2. Then we key in our we key in 1011000 into our calculator and we register 1011000 in our calculator. Then we press DEC. This one is BIN. Then after we register this one, we press DEC. Then we will get at the end best 10. So this part, I assume that it is very clear already because we've gone through this example a few times previously. So after we have converted 1011000 best 2 into a best 10 number, which is at the end best 10 now it's easy for us to convert it into a best 4 numbers so the methods that we're going to use is we're going to divide at the end by using 4 because we want the best 4 numbers so 4 to add for to add the remainder will be 0 since 22 can be divided by 4 again so we divide again 4 5 20 the remainder is 2 5 still can be divided by 4, so we divide again, 5 divided by 4, 4, 1, 4, the remainder is 1. So we write it bottom up, so we're going to have 1, 1, 2, 0, best 4. That is how we convert 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0, best 2 into a best 4 numbers. The examples that we're going to look into is uh, a relatively long questions and these questions also give us give us an insight that these questions have potential to come out in paper 2 so we cannot write off the possibility that number best can come out in paper 2 if it come out it is possible to be integrated in section C okay we go to the questions a restaurant serve 22012 best three food orders in six hours. In six hours. The restaurant opened for 12 hours a day. So that is the amount of food that been served in half a day only. So calculate the numbers of food orders served in 10 days. First of all, before we can find how many food been served in 10 days, we need to know how many food been served in one day. Before we can know how many food been served in one day, we need to know how many food been served in half of the operation time in that day, which is six hours. So it is two two zero one two best three. We don't know what is the value, so we have to find the numbers value. To find the numbers values, we're going to use two two zero one two best three. Since it is the best three numbers. So we write 3, 3, 3 on top. So the power increase from 0 to 1, 2, 3, 4 like that. Then do as usual. We're going to have 2 multiplied with 3 to the power of 4. 
plus 2 multiply with 3 to the power of 3 0 no need because anything multiplied with 0 is 0 so plus with 1 times 3 to the power of 1 plus with 2 multiply with 3 to the power of 0 we still need to multiply with we need we still need to multiply 2 with 3 to the power of 0 because 3 to the power of 0 is 1 all right so by using your calculator you will get the answer is 221 foot 221 foot in 6 hours so 6 hours 221 foot so one day is 12 hours how many foot you going to serve 442 foot in this one is one day so if the restaurant operate for 10 days so one day is the restaurant serve 442 food orders so 10 days will be 10 days we're going to have 442 times 10 so we're going to have 4420 food orders okay we go to the very end of this video uh, the video will end with this uh, last examples so this question is very time wasting because the number best that involved here all cannot be done by using calculator and it involves two different best and it involves the additions of number best which cannot be done by using calculators so the question asks us to add 2131 best 4 with 22 best 3 and leave the answer as a best 4 answer best 4 numbers so what we can do here is since we have a numbers of best 3 before we can add these two numbers together the first thing that we need to be sure of is the two numbers must be of the same best so what we can do here is we need to convert 2 2 best 3 into a numbers of best 4 how to convert 2 2 best 3 into a numbers of best 4 first of all we need to find the numbers in best 10 then we have to do divisions and get the numbers in best 4 so how to get the numbers in best 10 we will use the methods of number value so 22 best 3 so we write 3 3 power of 0 power of 1 so we have 2 multiply with 3 to power of 1 plus with 2 multiply with 3 to power of 0 so we're going to have 6 plus 2 which is 8 to the power of 10 after we have the value of 2 2 best 3 as at in the best of 10 then we can do division to get the value of to get the digit in to get the number in the form of best 4 so we divide best add with best 4 so 4 2 add the remainder is 0 2 cannot be divided by 4 again so this one is the final answer so 2 0 best 4 2 0 best 4 now we have done converting 2 2 best 3 into 2 0 best 4 so we go back to the questions 2 1 3 1 best 4 plus with 2 2 best 4 all right now since the number is in the same best and it also correspond to the answer that they want which is an answer in the form of number best 4 so we can continue and proceed to do the addition so we have 2 1 3 1 best 4 plus with 2 2 best 4 okay bear in mind that this one is a best 4 numbers so the largest numbers that involve is 3 because only number 0 1 2 3 is allowed to be used in the numbers of best 4 so 1 plus 2 is 3 3 
doesn't exist for so it's okay so 3 plus 2 is 5 okay this 5 is not in the range of the numbers that is allowed for numbers of best 4 so we need to remove the 4 from the numbers so remain 2 okay remain 2 so where did the 4 that we remove go the 4 that we remove from 5 will become 1 okay in the place in front okay so we go into have 1 plus 1 which is 2 then 2 plus nothing so it's 2 so the answer will be 2 2 2 3 best 4 all right with this i end the video thank you very much